What up, everyone? It is your boy Zach, number one, most favorite, most number one Fortnite fan, number one, most favorite, most number one Seahawks fan. And today, uh, I'll be talking about the story of Jack and Dexter's because of legacy. Uh, sorry that my video got interrupted there. My battery was very low. Was at five percent. Sorry about that, boys and girls. But the girls are like, oh, you better charge it. I am right now. Right now, set. Six percent? Okay, I'll do my video now. Okay, two things I want to say. First thing is, pause this video for a moment, subscribe, and turn on notifications, like the video, and comment down below, I subscribed, and I will give you a shout out. The second thing is, Crashy News on Twitter keeps spamming notifications these days. Every morning, evening, and night, I know there's spammers. I'll get rid of crash news notifications as soon as fast as I can. All right, here we go. So, um, so first of all, at the beginning of the game, um, Dexter, the one that fell into that Dexter, that one guy, fell into the dark eco, and he turned into a little orange. Furry oxal. Orange little furry oxal. With glasses or something like that. And they're like, what? And they're like, like, I'm fine. I'm fine. And, like, it's like, and he looked down himself and, like, and go, Way! That's like my most favorite part, right? But. But. Uh. It's like uh, crazy because a uh, junk piece of junk. Little dark ooze that doesn't look friendly. The green thing japs about it because it's all the time. What do go? What do go? Why did they build all this heck? And then Jack said, uh, he wasn't actually speechless. He only said one word, uh, and that's it. But anyways, um, and so, Daxter fell in the dark, e dark eco, and he turned into a little furry oxal. And so, back in Sandova Village, uh, the Green Sage told Jack and the team of Jack and Daxter that there was one sage that, one sage that, that can change back the little orange, orange little furry arts of Daxter, but got like a wrong, couldn't. So, he, so Jack and his little orange little furry arts of Daxter, uh, took his, the zoom, he had to collect 20 power cells to get to Fire Canyon, because, and he couldn't hop right through it, or jump right through it, because it was too, it was a volcanic rock, and way too, way too hot. And so, the, he had to take a Zima and go straight to Rock Village. So, the center of a village was a green sage. And then, he went to Rock Village, which is a blue sage. And, all, and, all, he had, and Jack and Daxter had to collect 45 power cells to lift up the, the boulder with the laser, blue laser thing. And... Um, after that, they had to beat the monster claw that keeps throwing rocks into the village and uh, let all people run away from the dude. But this one guy, he's like, ah, I'm tough ones. Ah, yeah. But don't tell me about that monster again. And he kept on crying. And now, uh, and this also what, and, and then Kira told Jack and Dexter that they, yeah, and then, yeah, the 45 pounds was one. And then I had to lift up, lift up the boulder to beat Far Claw and beat the nasty monster in the, the mountain pass. And then, after that, they had to get to Volcanic Crater before the lookers blew up the mountain pass. And they didn't blow up the mountain pass, which is good. And so, Jack and Daxter made it through the mountain pass to Volcanic Crater, which is a red sage. 
in the red sage, which is in volcanic crater. And so, the green sage said, Whoa! These teleport gates are worse than the ones that we have. Yeah, so I can lose all body parts in that thing. The, the, the little warp gates in Jack and Dexter because of Legacy. And so, and so, um, and Kira told them that they, that Kira, Kira had to load up the gondola and Kira would have to give an update to Jack and Dexter. And Kira said, you need 75, well, not that 75, sorry. You need 72 power cells to journey more, to journey through more. 72 power cells to get to lava tube. 72 power cells to power up the uh, heat shield for the Zuma. And now, it can only stand up within 800 degrees. And if it hits 800 degrees, and it's over. Not molten over, but the Zuma will actually blow up. So they made it through lava tube and got to the Yellow Sage's lab. And so Kira was quiet because a Green Sage got kidnapped. And so Dash was like, Whoa, the Schwartz and Winkly. And Kira was like, Oh, this is terrible. The Green Sage got kidnapped and Yolamara kidnapped him as well. And so gotta. Stop them before it's too late! And Jack, please be careful. <laughs> yeah, and so, uh, um, so Jack went through the Gone Myers Citadel, right? And rescued every sage, including the Blue Sage, Red Sage, Yellow Sage, and Green Sage, and every sage, and and so, and Gal Galakaron and Maya, and said, "You were too, you were too, you were too late." Dark Econ can now shape and twist, and destroy the whole world. And the Green Sage Samus is like, "That's impossible." And so, um, what Gal and Maya had to do. Is go inside this precursor robot, and they had to go all the way up to the highest tippy tippy tip tip. Well, the whole thing was actually, you know, just a blue thing, and there was a, it wasn't a blue thing. It was a peach. It was a donkey called Silos. Sorry. Anyways, um, and they stopped the precursor robot. And they use the laser to open up the uh, the dark eco silos. They use a laser, the orange gun, and the little you know the the gun things. And they opened up the dark eco. Well, right, the dark eco silos. And the green same the green sage is like not the silence, but uh, and so also the final form of Jack was the white ego, and um, Dexter the orange little fellow he also did is like white ego that could be the stuff to change me back. Oh, uh, stay fuzzy or save the world. Stay fuzzy, try choices, choices. All right, we'll save the world before I change my mind. And so, Jack grabbed the the white eco, became Super Saiyan, and took out Gaul and Maya, the Picasso robot. And Gaul and Maya were speechless, and oh, they only said this. That's the fake! Right? Well, first, Jack turned into the Super Saiyan white god. And what they mean is actually that's the fake, which means that's fake, you know, right? But that wasn't fake. It wasn't. And so Jack used the white eco streams to take out the robot, and it took out the precursor robot in one hit. And so they went all the way down at the bottom of the dark eco silence. 
And um, and and at the end of the game, um, Dexter is like, "Can't beat him again, right, Jack? Right, Jack? Yeah, this bad guy. I mean, Dexter could be right. There could be plans for Jack and Dexter to return of God and Maya. There, could, there was there were plans, but they made a Jack and Dexter for the Lost Ones here. There might be a Jack and Dexter five. I, I we don't actually know on that." All, all we do know is that uh, they're making a P uh, the Naughty Dog and the rest of the team making a PS5. Sony Entertainment's making a PS5 first, and then release a Jack and Dexter game on that thing after the PS5 releases. That's all we know. That's all we know. And so, um, D Jack and Dexter collected all 101 power cells, opened up the ancient precursor door, and locked. The same, the, the the new things for Jack to Renegade. So it was like the the, the Rift Rider in the ancient because the door Jack and Dexter because the legacy the the Rift Rider was in there, and so they had to go back. To, I think inside the ancient because the door is the Rift Rider, and they had to go through. The huge, huge warp gate, I believe, with the Rift Rider, and that took them, and that took them back to the Sandova Village, and the same thing in Jack Two Renegade, I believe. So, uh, there could be a possible Jack and Dexter Five after the PS Five releases. We don't know yet, but we will see on that. And hopefully you enjoy the story of Jack and Dexter because of legacy. Credits, comments, and the outro. My name is Zach. Catch you later in the next video. Peace out, y'all.